Colossians 1, 25, of which I became a minister according to the stewardship from God that was given to me for you to make the word of God fully known. So what's he talking about? What is he talking about this of which I became a minister? Well, that's what we see from the last verse is he's talking about the gospel. Paul is, he is all about the gospel. He's become a servant of the gospel. And he's saying right here that this of the gospel, of the gospel of which he became a minister. Again, this is the second time we've seen this. This is the word deacon. He is a servant, which we should be reminded that our churches are often not biblically organized because they have deacons who are not serving, but they're ruling. They're acting as elders. And we need to make sure that if we have deacons in our churches, that they're acting as deacons, as servants, and that elders are acting as elders or as pastors. So he became a minister of the gospel. And it says here, this is really cool, according to the stewardship from God. It's this word stewardship. So Paul sees that he has been given the gospel and that he needs to be a responsible steward of the gospel. So what does it mean to be a responsible steward of the gospel? Well, that's what he's going to say. He says this is this is the stewardship that was given to 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 him, right? Who's he given to? Him? Jesus. Jesus gave him the gospel and he needs to be a wise steward of it. And if he's going to be a wise steward of it, right here, to make the word of God fully known. That's a, that's such a big deal. If he is going to be a wise if he's going to be a wise steward of the gospel, then he needs to make the word of God known fully. And so for us too, we can learn from this that if you are in Christ, then you have been given the gospel, and that means that you are a steward of the gospel. And are you responsibly stewarding the gospel. This is the gospel has been given to you, right? Just like it was given to Paul to the Colossians, it's given to us. And what do we need to do with it? We need to make the word of God fully known. That means not only do we need to make sure we're expressing all of the word of God, but we need to be expressing all of the word of God to everyone so that we can responsibly handle this gospel that we've been entrusted with.